I got another video for you guys showing um when you get the Titan get um gas fuel cap um the Titan gas fuel cap on the screen inside the car where it says Titan gas cap um this is the purge solenoid and basically what this purges the solenoid the solenoid purges the um evap system so um the the gas cap thing doesn't hold enough pressure because this becomes this line here this line here sometimes get gets clogged so either check this line here if you get that um tighten uh, gas cap and the gas cap is good check this line here just um just uh, get a needle nose, needle nose pliers. Mine, for some reason, I didn't even need any pliers to take it off. It just slides right off or whatever. And what I did was I took it off and I just, you know, blow through it. Or blow some compressed air through it. And just check and see if it's blocked. Mine isn't blocked. And um, if that's not blocked and the hose is still good, then you got to um, replace the solenoid. It's about... A hundred dollars? I think it's like a hundred dollars from the dealership. And uh, you press the tab on this side. In. Pull this out. Then there's a 10 millimeter. Bolt right here. Unscrew this. Just one screw here. Put this on the top. The other one I'm going to need an extension because it's on the bottom down here. So I'm going to add an extension to it to take out the bottom screw. Unscrew this 10 millimeter down here because I loosened it already. There's a hose also on the bottom that's connected that I'm also gonna um, disconnect once I pull it out. Then I'm gonna put everything back in. It's another 10 millimeter right here. It's long. Get my needle nose pliers. Pull this down. This is it. When you buy it from the dealer, it'll come looking just like this. And then you just uh, put everything back in reverse order. 
bottom holes. Put that up. so no air gets in. <sighs> Sorry about my hand trying to do this at the same time with the camera here. So I started screwing in the bottom bolt. Now you put in the top bolt. Turning it as much as I could. You want me to over tighten this? This you can tighten on like 15 foot pounds of torque. I Me, mean, I just hand tighten these because. It's held on tight already. And then you uh you put the holes back. That goes down here. See it sits over. It goes down. Then put the other holes back on on this side. Slide it over, it's nice and tight. And then you plug it back in. And you're done. You've had Purge Solenoid replaced. If you guys have any questions, uh, feel free to ask. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share my videos. Thanks. Bye.